I tried Motorola's MIUI 6.0. Is it better than MIUI? Of course it is. Why so? We'll talk about some of the things in this video. So stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end. Previous version which was Motorola's MIUI 5.0, I made a video on that one too. And this is Motorola's MIUI 6.0, both of them having Android 13. I just tried it after some time on my device as a ported ROM. My device is Mi 11X. It is having Xiaomi and of course it is having MIUI by default. But after unlocking bootloader and installing my UI on my device I found that this is far more better than me UI why so because firstly it is not having any kind of blotware it is not having any kind of ads not a junky UI it is having very simple minimal UI but it still gives you some great features for you the default launcher is having only useful things where you can customize icon size you have the option for home screen styles and swipe access the quick settings panel is also quite important amazing you can see in the left we have the some shortcut tiles like wi-fi mobile data and bluetooth in the right we have two sliders first one is for volume second one is for brightness and we have some extra tiles options available i mean it is kind of similar to miui 2 but miui's control control center basically the quick settings panel is a bit laggy for some of the devices if if you are using a mid-range xiaomi device you will definitely feel notice but in this case my ui is super smooth although i have not tried motorola's device yet but the software experience is just so amazing because it is having some useful things not useless things anywhere in personalized section same like miui you have the option for theming options fonts colors icon packs same kind of things but just like stock android basically this is a mixture of stock android plus miui it is having a stock kind of ui almost everywhere you have the option to customize the wallpapers fonts themes etc if you move on to the wallpapers options some static wallpapers some live wallpapers all the options are available here for you if you need one of them you can definitely give it a try and by the way if you're using mi 11x if you're using xiaomi's mi 11x poco f3 redmi k40 you want to install this you want to experience this on a device I will provide you the link in the description for this one. We also have some fonts options. We have icon pack customizations. By the way, in icon pack, we have the Moto's adaptive icon pack, which is basically themed icons, but it's not working perfectly fine for every app right now. But that's just literally fine. It's totally optional. You can simply use the default Moto's icon pack. Layout customization, icon shape customization, sound, dark mode, etc. So all the useful things are present here. It also includes this kind of system engine where you have the option to make your device more powerful I guess of course we have some tweaks available you have the option to choose between the battery saving mode balanced mode and turbo turbo which means more performance so basically more CPU cores and basically for the users or for that time whenever you want to do gaming on a device it might be device specific so not going to talk much about these things it also gives you the device shield app same like miui like in miui you have the security app and in this case we have the device shield app but in device shield unlike miui it is having some good options we have the option ready to anti-spam app cloner app cloner is also present in miui but there's a major difference in miui's app cloner and motorola's miui app cloner what is that for example if i want to clone 1dm plus if i click once we have one clone available if i click twice we have two clones available and like this i can make around five cloned apps for a single app but in miui you can't do that this is a very interesting thing about Motorola's MIUI 6.0 that you can create approximately five cloned apps for a single app and you can simply force clone any app and that's super useful we have the option for anti-spam etc screen time so these are some useful features included you can see here we have these options the file manager is also amazing by the way i'm using this as a ported rom so not going to talk much about these things although everything is super amazing the screen time options are present you have the option for customizations for home screen lock screen and that control center which i was talking about if you need to stock android kind of quick settings panel you have the option to enable that too and that is one of the main major advantages of using my UI. I found that there were there was no video regarding my UI 6.0 on YouTube. That is why I thought that I shall make it. But yes, this was my experience. If you want to install on me 11x, link is available in the description. If you like this video, don't forget to like it. Goodbye.